Hello. Today we will be looking at the third and final type of chemical bonding, metallic bonding. A metallic bond forms due to the electrostatic attraction between a metal's positive ion and the delocalized electrons they release to form the ion. So, how is a metal structured? We'll use sodium as an example. Sodium forms Na plus ions and the ions are attracted to the electrons they release. The electrons are free to move, or delocalized as there are no non-metal atoms to take them. Pure metals, like sodium are arranged in repeating layers. Knowing all of this, what are some of the key properties of metals? Those strong bonds require a lot of energy to overcome so metals have high melting and boiling points. The layers can slide over each other so metals are malleable or able to be bent. The delocalized electrons allow the metal to conduct electricity. Finally, light can reflect off of metal ions and this makes them appear shiny or lustrous. Right, when we add another metal to a pure metal, we create an alloy. The different sized atoms in an alloy disrupt the layers of the pure metal. This makes alloys less malleable. Alloys also have high melting and boiling points but they are stronger than pure metals. This is because the variety in atom sizes disrupts the repeating layers in the pure metal which once allowed it to be malleable. Thanks for watching and I hope this was helpful. Please comment below what I could improve on in these videos.